Start by removing the diverter knob, the handle, hub, escutcheon, and faceplate. Shut off the water with the service stops on the valve. Put a towel in the wall under the valve body to avoid water spills behind the wall. Unscrew and remove the off thread with centering sleeve. Remove the nut cap with a 21 32 inch plumber socket wrench. Then remove the cartridge nut with a 1 and 7 16 of an inch plumber socket. Gently wiggle the cartridge and pull it out. Make sure no seals from the existing cartridge are still inside the body. Check the temperature limit stop the red ring and remember its position. Use a long slotted screwdriver inside the cartridge brooch to loosen the screw and remove the brooch. Remove the brooch on the new replacement cartridge and set the temperature limit stop to match the original cartridge to the new cartridge. Reinstall the original brooch onto the new cartridge and tighten the screw inside the brooch. Take the new pressure balance cartridge with brooch. Look at the bottom of the cartridge to check all seals are in place and the locator post must fit inside the locator holes in the body. Slide the cartridge into the body with the up arrow at 12 o'clock and lock it in place. Screw the cartridge nut back on and tighten firmly with a 1 and 7 16 plumber socket. Screw the nut cap back onto the cartridge nut with a 21 32 inch plumber socket. Screw the existing off thread with centering sleeve back onto the valve hand tight. Open the hot and cold service stops and then check for leaks. Remove the rag and reinstall the faceplate, escutcheon, hub, diverter knob, and handle.